Hi guys, we're looking at a couple of my old sea fishing weights here. One's three ounces and one's four ounces. And the reason we're looking at them is in the comments on one of my cars, somebody was saying they have to make a gravity powered car and the weight or the mass they're allowed to use is 200 grams to drive the car forwards. So I've had a quick look at my calculator here, or conversion calculator, and it tells me that 200 grams is the equivalent of 7.054792.39 ounces. So 3 and 4 is 7. That should be close enough to 200 grams to make one of these cars. So we'll see what we can do. Right, to make this gravity car, I'm just going to modify my rubber band powered car number 8. Simply because that will make it nice and quick and simple, uh, just to test whether it actually works or not. So, the wheels are CDs with milk bottle tops hot glue to them. Uh, the back wheels are actually CDs stuck onto a thick wooden dowel. The chassis is made out of plastic um, trunking as it's called. The other bits on there we don't need so I'm going to take as much of that off as I can. And I'm just going to mount a tripod on top made out of my flower canes to support the weights. And we'll just see how far it goes like that. Right, found a little plastic pulley in my bits and pieces drawer. That's come from a printer at some time or other. And I've just bent a paper clip into a sort of a triangular shape. I'm going to hot glue it to the end of that flower cane and then add two more flower canes to make a tripod and then glue them onto the bodywork about here somewhere. Attach a weight on the end of the bit of line, wrap it around the axle and see how far we go. OK, release. the other end. So there we go, that's my gravity powered car using 200 grams or 7 ounces of lead weight. Quick summary, all we've done is we've erected a tripod on top of my rubber band powered car number 8, which is the one that I, I use as a test bed for all of my modifications, or most of my modifications. There's a pulley that's on a piece of bent paper clip. two weights. I've put the bottom of a um, pop bottle there just to catch the weights so they don't fall on the floor. Uh, potentially you could let them fall on the floor and let the car run over them but you might find the wheels get stuck on them so I thought it was neater to catch them. Now that's it, very simply wraps around a pulley on the back there, pulley, around a peg on the back there wind up the back axle to actually wind up the string or as I've used here I've used fishing line and we've got five meters out of it. I think I'll do another one of these um, made from scratch rather than just modifying this car but I just wanted to prove whether it worked and clearly it works. 
So we'll see if we can do another one.